Hi. Hi. Ha, ha, hi. Oh, oh, what am I saying? I don't know. So today, I'm going to try and do full freckles because one of my favourite channels here on YouTube, It's Likely Makeup. Right, Geordie from that channel is absolutely gorgeous. She is who I wish I looked like. She's just beautiful. She's unique. Her makeup skills are just at the, the highest level they could ever be at. And I love her whole style. And she always does faux freckles, but she does them so subtly and beautifully that they look just like they were meant to be there. And so it's inspired me now to think, and when you too could try the faux freckles. I know my makeup skills are not that good. If if you're looking at the ladder of makeup skills and you've got It's Likely Makeup Geordie at the very top, I'm not even on the bottom rung. I'm kind of like, like underneath the bottom rung, like saying, hey, hi, I'm trying my best to improve, okay? I'll, I'll get up onto the first rung soon. I'm, I'm really trying hard, yes, I am. So that's me, so anyway, I'm gonna just try it. I watched her tutorial, which I'll link below, on faux freckles, it was a faux freckles 101. And I feel like I've got all the tools that I may need, although the brushes that I have are not exactly the same as the ones that she recommended. But I've got this one here, which is a Zoeva eyebrow brush. Uh, her brush was like a really like thin, like pointy brush. So like I was figuring though, I didn't have one of those, but I thought I could use this one and like use that bit, the tip bit at the end. Like that's what I was thinking. And also I've got this one and this, this was me thinking outside of the box. Okay. I thought, I'm going to think creatively. You don't have the brush that, that Geordie recommends. I thought this because I could like go like this. I don't know. I, I don't know. Probably won't use that brush. Okay, so I've got my Deep Brow Pomade in Taupe. This is by ABH. And I think one of the boys has been messing in this because, I mean, I didn't create this chaos that you see in there. Body just recommends to dip the tip of your brush in. Obviously, this brush is not the one that she recommended. And I actually feel like mm, maybe this isn't the right shade. For me, I should have like more of a like grey light shade, I don't know, but she just kind of said to go like, oh, I'm scared. It's like, you know, making the first, like the first cut is always the deepest. The first freckle's always the most trickiest. I think I don't know. Anyway, so I'm dipping in. She's dipping and she's just going to go for it. Should we go like this? And also, Jordy says, I can't see anything. Can you see? I can't see anything. By the way, I've had my foundation on for a good few hours now. And it's looking like it's oxidised. And I'm not liking, actually. Testing a new foundation. It don't like how it's sitting on my face. I'm not into it. So, please ignore my skin in this video. Okay, right. I need a closer look here. So, I'm going to dip in. Right, okay, we're going now. I'm doing it. She's doing it. Nothing's happening. Oh, a little bit happened. I'm, I'm dipping in a bit more. And Geordie said, just like lightly, nothing's happening. I feel like this pomade is dried up. Why, why is it not doing anything in terms of freckles? We're going again. I just don't, oh, I'm going. She's going, oh, she's going. Like, see, that doesn't look very freckle-like, does it? It just looks like I've got a brush and some eyebrow pomade and then put it on my nose this is not the the freckly look i was going for okay let's try she said to go like this like really quickly around the face instead of being really like precise she said the way to do it is like just go like this and and keep keep them quite far apart from one another Am I getting away with this yet? Maybe if I go all the way back here, getting away with it yet? Okay, no, probably not. Okay, by the way, oh, excuse me. I'm trying to do a video here, making all that noise on the table. By the way, 
if this is bad, it's in no way a reflection of uh, Jordi's tutorial because she did a great tutorial. It's just a reflection of how bad my makeup skills are in general. Okay, so I'm going to do the technique where we go like this. Oh no, I've messed this one up. Oh, I've messed this up really bad. There's no way back for me now. Oh. Can you see? I really messed it up. I mean, I think it was going okay. It wasn't by any way professional performance. But it was going okay, I feel, before this. And I just got a little bit too excited. I just, I got carried away. I got confident because I, I made a couple of good freckles. I got carried away. And then this happened. Look at this. Hmm. Okay. I love the freckles, like, on the nose. So, oh. Like, these are not freckles in so much as, like, I don't know what they are. Lines? I don't know. Do you know what? I wish I had freckles now. This is making me even... Right, if it wasn't for this, let's be honest here. If it wasn't for this area here, would you not think Amwin has great freckles? Like, I've not noticed them before, but they're really nice freckles. Like, and, and also, I mean, a bit on the nose, it went a bit wrong. But, like, this side looks kind of, you know, passable, do you think? Maybe? No? Oh, I don't know. Oh, do you know what? I tried. You can't knock a girl for trying. I gave it my best shot, and I'm sitting back here so that you can't look at how poorly I did any longer. So, it's... A disappointment. I'm going to have to work on it. I'll keep trying faux freckles. I really want to master the faux freckles. I want to. I want it to be like my everyday makeup look because it looks so cute on people who can do it and just so terrible now, which is a real shame. But anyway, you can't knock a trier. You cannot knock a trier. If you're interested in actually seeing how you could get amazing faux freckles, Go to the link that I'll post below. Check out Jordi's channel. She's absolutely spectacular. So amazing. I wish I was her. She's amazing. So anyway, thank you for watching. Me and my faux freckles. I mean, I wish Anton was coming home now because I could just go like this. I could go stand in the kitchen waiting for him like, Hey, honeys! And just see how long it would take him to notice. And it would be really interesting to see what would honey say. I may actually do a Snapchat to honeys so he can see my freckles and I'll go and then he'll go oh, what has she been doing now she's always up to something he'll say anyway I'm gonna go I'm gonna leave you to it to have a great day whatever it is you're doing I've got a bit of cracker stuck in the front of my teeth because I ate some cracker before have a great day great to see you here we I'll try freckles again at some point in the future if at first you don't succeed, try again, is what they say. Okay, bye!